We're here at uh, GET 2016, the second global forum on emergency telecommunications in Kuwait. And I'm very pleased to be joined by Mr. Monisei Lafay, who is Minister for the Ministry of Communications and Transport for Tuvalu. Minister, thank you very much indeed for being with us in the studio today. My pleasure. Now, I'd like to start off by talking about uh, Tuvalu uh, and asking you about your experience in disaster management. Uh, I think it is fair to say that we, we do have some experience uh, in terms of uh, disaster management in Tuvalu. Uh, but looking at our legislation, uh, we have a piece of uh, legislation uh, called the uh, National Disaster Management Act. Uh, it's a fairly short uh, act. Uh, in fact, it's only 14 pages uh, long and I, I understand it deals with the very basics, the very rudimentary requirements for a response effort and a preparedness in terms of a, a national disaster. But I, I will certainly be benefit from learning from uh, the experiences of, uh, of our regional neighbours and others, uh, how they, they're dealing with uh, their disaster management plans and, uh, and stuff like that. What are your major concerns with regards to disaster management? I think uh, the most critical thing is in preparedness, uh, the early warning system, uh, whether we have that, uh, those basic infrastructure in place. And uh, uh, the key is to, to know in advance, well in advance, uh, when we're going to be hit by a, a disaster. And for you, it's mainly rising sea levels, is that, that uh, and, and, and weather, weather issues? Uh, yeah. The, especially with uh, uh, countries like Tuvalu, which are very low-lying atolls, and uh, yeah, civil, uh, sea level rise is uh, an issue, probably the most uh, challenging issue, and, uh, and, of, and of course our size, our remoteness, uh, makes us extremely vulnerable to, uh, to elements of, uh, like uh, from the weather and cyclones and strong winds and stuff like that. You touched on it briefly, but how can ICTs help in reducing the impact of natural disasters? Uh, absolutely. Uh, information is an absolute must in terms of uh, disasters. People need to know what is happening. Uh, they, they need to know whether uh, to take shelter, whether to take shelter, what, need to, what they need to have before and after uh, nat natural disasters. Uh, so information and how we can communicate to people uh, during those times is an absolute necessity. And what about development? How important is development in disaster management? Uh, we need to have uh, infrastructure in place. Uh, to be able to communicate, we need to have the infrastructure. So development is important, it's paramount. We need to have those uh, system uh, install all the, all the the equipment, the necessary equipment, so we can communicate. Uh, but otherwise, uh, there's going to be a lot of problems. Now you've come a long way to be at this meeting. I wanted to ask you, how can events like uh, GET 2016 help stakeholders join forces for a, a better tomorrow? I think they are important. They are extremely important, uh, especially having attended uh, a couple of uh, ITU uh, conferences. Uh, it's, a, it's a very powerful tool of uh, getting to uh, inform, getting to educate uh, state member countries. And uh, it, it, they are, like I said, they are important. Uh, we will stand to learn a lot from uh, these experiences and hopefully get to disseminate the information to our, our own people in, uh, at national level. Mr. Lai-Fi, thank you very much for being with us today. My pleasure. Thank you.